working for home y'all never ends yeah i know it is 11 something it's friday y'all see my black girl bonnet i need to cover up my edges more but yeah nala is down to sleep noelle is down in the bassinet she a little bit too far for me to show y'all but we have been struggling with trying to keep baby girl occupied during these quarantine type of days and she's getting really bored and we have a hard time shelter her in in the living room so it's a little crazy but let me show y'all what we've been doing we've been having to bring toys out from the room up in here this is the living room we had to bring the high chair because that was becoming too far away we had to bring the swing in here for noelle and barricade it so that N nala doesn't try to take noelle's life and it's just getting hectic and on top of this we're using her old playpen to prevent her from walking out as well as using car seat and a mamaru to barricade her from walking into the kitchen noah actually does like the mamaru but the only time we can use it is when nala is not in here because she will try to like grab her so we can't even use this so because of all this which is really 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 stressful we have decided that we're gonna buy um some baby eights baby gates for the measures that we need it for is expensive okay it's expensive we end up paying 280 dollars i think mm. for two gates ouch ouch so the first one that came in was this one okay it just got here and it got beat up okay nothing better be missing in here because they didn't have no remorse in how they treated this gate so we got the one is from summer infant it's extra tall and extra wide so i'm hoping everything goes fine so i'm about to open it up david is extra excited as i am yes get to move this because every time she's in this she has a fit so this just became a catch-all because she has this bad habit of just throwing stuff inside of here so that's why it's just all kind of stuff it's just nothing makes sense during these quarantine type of days so let's just go ahead and move this out the way y'all don't talk about our house dog y'all know what's up that was white me too did i make a mistake no, it looked like I ordered gray. You ordered gray? That's what it looked like. They don't even have a white. <sighs> I ain't think that through. Obviously. I guess I'm going to paint these walls. Well, because the, the picture was white. but. I guess I'm going to paint the walls gray. Whatever. Place these floors eventually. Now we're going to have a white in the gray gate in the same room. Yeah, that one's white? Yeah. It looks big. This better work out, dog. Hold it down. Let me grab the instructions because you know black men don't like to. So this is the what the instructions look like. I guess um, it looks like you could just conform it however you want to. Is this screw in or pressure? It's pressure. Are both of them pressure? Mm-hmm. Uh. I like it though. It's tall. Because at, at the end of the day, I found like screwing ones, but then I was like, well, maybe I should get a taller gate because you know, Nala's so tall. Yeah, I screwed this in the bottom. Oh, Jesus. Okay. How does this happen? You squeeze it. Just twist it. Like if you want it more out, you'll twist the bolt in. Oh. But for now, just squeeze it all the way in because oh, we don't know what it. it's. Okay. Well, let me look at it. Did you like to slide into the bottom too? Oh, it's slide. <laughs> do this one then. 
<laughs> do this one like that, dude. Okay. Since she's so smart. Well, I read instructions. Hmm. I do like this locking mechanism because I do think it would be hard for her to actually figure it out. Yeah. And I believe our baby gate, our second baby gate is here. That's the one I'm most worried about because what has to happen is, oh, baby's waking up, is that we're going to pressure the gate against the chair and the wall. So that's the one that we paid the most money for. That one went by itself is $200. So. I'm hoping for the best. Is it closed by itself? If anyone get caught, that they did. Yeah. The goal is to, for her to not realize that she's like actually pent up. And I think that's a problem with the pay yard. She knows she's pent up, so she has an attitude, so. She's probably gonna have an attitude either way, but at least this way she don't feel as in a small space. Now David need to come over here and test it out. All right. It's a little. Is it supposed to do that? Yeah. Yeah, it's a, I don't know if you guys see that, but that's, I guess, a way that it, it's like a part of its mechanism. It goes up and down. Yeah. I seen that earlier. We can finally move this out of the way. This is going to be interesting to see how it does on the couch. I know. I cannot wait to get rid of this floor. Y'all see how quickly these carpet get dirty, especially with the cheap carpet too that come with these houses. This is as good as I can get it with the situation of not having an actual wall. Cause this is a little bent. But we actually need a holder for that. Yeah, put this one here. Maybe that'll be better. Yeah, I think that made it better. So, does it close on its own or it works? And I like that it has this little kick thing because then David can't trip over it as much. But with this one, it has these little metal plate at the bottom. Yeah, that is it. We can finally clean up this area and take a lot of this bulky stuff out this playpen was taking up too much and it was so annoying to pull it back and push it and all that stuff so now whenever noelle wakes up i can move this either in that little corner there or move it here we just bought a playhouse kitchen so we're gonna put that in that corner and noelle doesn't use that much but yesterday she just sleep in it for a long time so i'm not really sure but we can just clean up because, y'all, it's a lot. Quarantine has cut up our house. Let me tell you that because the baby's bored. They don't go out much. Yesterday, we had to drive in a car just to get her settled. Look at who was awake. Excuse her hair. You know, she lost the rubber band and that one popped out. But she was looking at the baby gate. Kind of crazy because we just went through it and she don't even know what that is. Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. So I'm going to lay her down, get her settled, give her her milk. We usually put her on this little, the bobby pillow or the lounge chair or something. 
last few. Actually, you hold this. Hold the camera while I switch here. Cause it's usually this one. She don't stay in as long. Mm -hmm. As this one. Don't look at my booty. Mm -hmm. Sadly, she can still fit in. She big, but she cool. Hey, baby. <laughs> now, get her her milk. And she living her best life. Let's put on her shoes. Which right now is Sesame Street. Fun fact, I've seen that Big Show have a new show <laughs> called Big Show, but it's based in Tampa. Who would have thought Tampa was that popular? Or popular enough to have this? Not me. You, babe? <laughs> What's up, baby? Say goodbye. Say bye bye. Say bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. You're putting all your pressure on it. Jail. Look at all this space, baby. So, we took a mini break, dance break, workout, whatever you call it. Now, that we got our baby shower it's a prop up pillar and the concept is they're supposed to be able to like sit up like this but also kind of do tummy time with um, rolling it it gives them something to kind of play with at the same time so I'm curious uh, how this will go I'm wondering maybe it's too soon for this because I really thought this was the circle one well, she could do tummy time on it. I don't know. I guess I'll just take it out just to get rid of the box. But the one I thought this one was the one on Amazon. Comes in this package like this. It's a lot um, smaller than I thought it would be. This is what it is. It's this. Um, this is a lot smaller as far as width wise or narrow than I thought it would be but it's a good start uh, process to get them to sit up I guess let's take this down it's too soon for this for her to sit up in it so I guess they are supposed to lay over it like this yeah I would want this to stay on there so that she don't slide but she can play with these toys. There's a teether toy right here. What's the age suggestion on here? Zero months. So they're supposed to be able to sit this at zero months like a newborn? Mm -hmm. But they ain't showing the newborn do this though. Yeah. I may... I may end up trying this later. I don't know for her tummy time. Maybe when I'll sleep. But we'll see how that goes, but continue to the cleaning up part.
Man, I really cannot wait to take out these floors. Like for real, for real. Having kids and coming out and just this little space right here. Like it would look so much better if it was just like wood or vinyl. It don't really matter, but anything but what it is. I wish we could find the same towel and bring it all in here. No, I'm lying. I don't even want this towel. David just wants to keep it because it's cheaper. But I really want to take it all out. But man, cheap carpeting. It stains so easily. But look how dirty these floors get. With the virus going around, I don't know how we're going to get these floors done. But now that we got some money and potential to be able to do it, now we scared of getting sick. What are we going to do? But finally we have a walkway again so i like this to set up a lot differently but time to clean up all this other stuff is, i always put too much on my plate when i already ate